Hey folks, this is Saiyan Chan. The preliminary title of today's episode is Take Photos with Your Colombian Girls. And while I talk specifically about Colombia, this goes in general for whenever you're on dates uh, with your girlfriends, traveling internationally, or, and even with just platonic friends. Because what I found is that for guys around, you know, average guys in in dating climates which are more difficult the western countries america canada australia uh london uh england for for a variety of reasons a lot of these guys are not doing well and are frustrated and are not getting the outcomes that they want and they don't really have much hope or inspiration and that's why i created this channel to talk directly to these guys to tell them that they're is hope and if you don't want to start earning a lot more money and doing a ton of self-improvement and screening in your home countries for the relatively rare women that are you know fit feminine friendly cooperative feminine beautiful inspirational then you're gonna have to go find that type of women somewhere else such as in Colombia the Philippines Thailand the Dominican Republic Brazil etc but let's talk about Colombia uh, let me first share with you guys some an example of from my own personal life to give you an idea of what I mean. Um, let's start with this one. So the girl to my to the left is a platonic friend who I've known for many many years. I'll post my link to the the link to my interview with her while we were on vacation together in Cartagena. Uh, some of you guys may have seen it already, but regardless, she is a girl that I consider a great friend who was of immense help to me in Colombia, who helped me translate when I was there and helped me you know, just organize and get things done. And she's just a cool girl to boot, not to mention she's pretty darn easy on the eyes and also nice and kind and feminine. So while I was on vacation, I'm like, hey. Uh, I'm, go I'm going to Cartagena, come with me. And then she said, sure. And then so we went on Cartagena, uh, w went on vacation to Cartagena together. And, uh, and for you guys who have never done this kind of stuff before, right? Maybe you, the, the virgins, the, the, the incels, guys on really years long dry, uh, like dry spells who never quite figured it out, this is for you. And so if you get yourself on, um, on dates or even just meet some girls platonically what I want you to do is to take photos of you with them this creates uh, not only a memory that you can look at and refer back to when you when um, when you when you need to it also gives you a hope and inspiration that yes one day you too could have a woman like this and that a woman would be you know would be interested in you like this and it doesn't it doesn't mean you had to have to hook up with them hook up with them or, or go on a date or, or anything more than that just having an image of you with women with women that you like and find attractive and who are your who are your type it's gonna break you out of that mental headspace w uh, that you might have developed in the United States of America where let's say you couldn't get any girls whatsoever. So uh, this is where the Saiyan Chan life coaching and consulting comes in, the life coaching part. Yes, while I've been helping guys set up trips to Colombia, some guys really need these practical tools and techniques to unmess up, unfuzz up your mind because You've been going through a dry spe spell for so long. You think you're ugly and you're unwanted and 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 that it's hopeless. No cute girls that you like will, will ever find you attractive. But I'm here to tell you, no, no, no. It's just the one of the major reasons is because the environment that you're you're in. So if you want, if you wind up meeting some cool girls in Colombia where things are easier, where the girls are more open and more friendly, take a photo. And after you take a photo, go print it out. Put it on your wall in front of your computer, and then you can look at it and stare at it and be like, "Yeah, that was cool. Um, that that trip was awesome. 
I, uh, I, I met a girl, you know, that were cool. There are lots of these girls out there like there and uh, out there and use it as inspiration for your life. For the guys who are more close to uh, me, uh, for, for example, who, while they did not get no success whatsoever had in the United States of America, the, the guys who realize, hmm, there's something off here, something is wrong, uh, let's see if there's something better out there in the world. Well, I'm here to tell you that absolutely there is something out, out there that's better in the world. It's called Colombia and the Colombian women. So for you guys, I also recommend you you at least get a few photos of um, of yourselves on dates with the kind and caliber of a woman that you like and have met in real life, so that when you're when you're back home in the United States of America and and maybe you're going through a massive dry spell or like me voluntarily having given up completely. Ab uh, abandoning dating in the USA uh, over 10 years ago, sometimes you're going to be wavering and you'll be like, oh my God, uh, maybe I can just find myself an American girlfriend. And then you can just look at the photos that you took and be like, oh heck no, I ain't settling. No freaking way. I'm going to Colombia because the end, like for me, one of the motivating reasons was because the end goal of marriage in America was un unacceptable absolutely unacceptable so to 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 power through loneliness and, and other life difficulties hey at least i have these photos i can look back to saying that i did it once i can do it again i can do it repeatedly it's not a problem there's a land full of women that are fbi feminine beautiful inspirational shout out to the godfather kevin samuels we love you got rest in peace and and um yeah that's it's it, it's a great tool so I'll show you one more. Some of you guys may have seen it, but uh, some of you may not. Um, th this is from an this is from a episode that I I did a long time ago about the most awesome Colombian girl I've I've ever met, and this is her. And this photo is out here because she happens to be a public figure. She's one of the she's the founder of one of the largest uh, dance schools. In Europe, uh, in France, she's now married, and this photo was taken uh, ten years ago when we were in a club together in Cali. Again, this was never my girlfriend. We never hooked up. She was only a platonic friend. She she likes big, beefy white guys, which I clearly am not. But uh, the fact is, we had a lot of a mm, lot of mutual affection for each other. We were both Latin dancers passionate about salsa, passionate about, about bachata and dance and, and teaching and, and the country of Colombia. We had a lot of friends in common and I met her my first night in Colombia and we've been friends ever since, now 10 years later. And while, while, um, while I knew that I, I had no, no shot with her and, I, I, you know, and because that was not a problem because there was just so many other available women. And, and I had slotted her in the friend zone a long time ago. The point is that there are girls like this, like to me at the time, was just breathtakingly like gorgeous, ridiculously beautiful. And the great energy, beautiful smile. And just I said, I said to myself, wow, I think I would like to find a wife like this one day. And any man that has her is, is very lucky. And, and I, I wish her only the best. That is another uh, thing that I would now recommend to the guys who are in the third category, who despite having a lot of success in, like maybe they're a Chad or a really tall, and, um, and, and they, then they are able to consistently get dates and meet women in America. Well, from the guys that I know who fit into this category, a lot of those hookups and flings, women just passing through, a lot of that is just very unfulfilling. And for the, you guys who, um, who who have, you know, achieved above average uh, success and uh, decent dating life, you will know that a large percentage of women that you will meet are an absolute waste of time. But despite me being in that category through sheer hard work and effort and being a Latin dancer and going to the clubs, over the years, I just keep on finding myself meeting women in Colombia that are truly FBI, feminine, beautiful, inspirational, not airheads, 
really cool. I would want to introduce them to my friends, even if they're not right to me. I feel that they would be additive to to a man's life and not like an embarrassment just to hit it and quit it and not not to show to your friends. Absolutely, I'd be willing to share. Um, to to bring around and to spend money on and time on and girls that are just really cool and nice people and you're gonna find an abundance of those in Colombia. So if you come across those and you know even though they might not be single they, uh, or whatever the case may be, still uh, take photos of them and put it on your wall and when so so as often as you can look back to to your memories. And, and think how think think about how how that there exists at least one woman out there that are really really great, which will give you hope and inspiration for the future that you may be able to find one for yourself. All right? No more of this doom and gloom nonsense. Okay? All it takes is a plane ticket. And if you need help, Say and Chan Life Coaching and Consulting is is available. I'll help you set up and plan an entire trip in just one session. Email sayinchan at protonmail.com if you're interested. And if you're if if you've had no history or success whatsoever with women, or your 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 experiences are so negative and that you're all messed up in the head and you need help reorienting yourself and fixing your life and and developing positive uh, reference experiences with women, say in Chan. Life coaching is definitely able to help, okay? Email Chan at protonmail.com. For everyone else, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Remember, go go on dates, go, go meet some great Colombian girls, treat them really nicely, take photos of them, make great memories together that you can take with you until we all got to go, all right? This is Saiyan Chan signing off, reminding us all to always cogitate and analyze.